unajua wa Kenya hawa lazima tuwaambie vile mambo iko. Hawa jumbe ambao wanasema watapinga finance bill hasa muswada wa housing. Muswada wa housing kwanza si taxation, si ushuru. Ukiwa mfanyikazi unaambiwa kama unachukua mishara 1013 ule wa chini unaambiwa utoe tatu. na ule amekuwa ajiri atoe tatu. alafu pesa uwekewe mahali izae riba ukitaka nyumba utapata nyumba ukitaka utaki nyumba utakuja kuchukua hiyo pesa so it's a saving lakini nimesikia wajumbe wanasema ati wataangusha mswada ya housing. Mimi nataka niwaambie hawa wajumbe wamekaa hapa wote. Na wale wananisikia. Wote anapewa milioni 30 kununua nyumba. Na speaker iko hapa. Yeye ndo ana sign. Milioni ngapi? Thalathini kila mjumbe wa Senate wa National Assembly na analipa ripa ya 3% wakati wa Kenya wengine wanalipa 18% wale mabonyenyi kina Kalozo kina Raila wanaishi Karen Wame, wa, wakati walikuwa ma, mawaziri hata hawa mawaziri wenzangu wanachukua 30 to 40 million ya kununua nyumba sasa imekuwaje wewe unapinga na wewe unachukua pesa ya ya bunge kununua nyumba na hawa wa Kenya ambaye hawana pesa na serikali iko na mipango iko na nia ya kuwapatia manyumba wewe unasema ukifika bunge utapinga there's a lot of dishonesty and deceit in the whole issue of housing levy But your excellency every leader will be remembered you have been given to lead 50 million Kenyans and to decide for them their security the security of their properties their livelihood their roads their water and everything your excellency you don't blink mimi najua vile mzee kibaki alikumbukwa wakati alitoa kwa kiti siku moja wa Kenya watakukumbuka ya kwamba wewe ndio ulikuwa wa kwanza kuwatoa wa Kenya kutoka slums kutoka zile manyumba za za slum areas mahali wa Kenya hawana maji hawana vio hawana maisha nzuri that time you will go into history na nyinyi wa, wa bunge wa national assembly Musitishwe nimesikia Kalonzo Yaksa anasema ati oh majina yatasomwa majina ya... speaker wa bunge amekaa hapo yeye ndo atatoa orodha Simulizikia siku ile Soipana alisema the eyes have it Simu nakumbuka eh? <laughs> Tutarudi hiyo maneno Your excellency hao watu wa Narok umewapanga na wame confirm lakini sasa mimi nataka tu yabwisho ni waombe tafadhali watu wa Narok tufanye kazi pamoja Kajiado tufanye kazi pamoja kaunti za wafugaji tufanye kazi pamoja Kenya viongozi wote wafanye kazi pamoja asanteni Mungu awabariki Thank you very much ndugu uh, Dwale tafadhali nimeombwa na women leaders uh, deputy speaker of the national assembly Sholei tafadhali kuja hapa kidogo tu salamiane watu alafu niende mara moja kwa governors tunipeane hii program tafadhali hebu mpigie makofi tafadhali asante asante thank you i can recognize you nilikuwa nafikiri ni 